so i decided to you know get on this fitness thing i want basically i want a four pack abs by summer or anytime this year so i decide you know what let me get my ass up put on this cute outfit and go to the gym I did this a little bit reluctantly because I'm trying to like figure out which gym I want to be a part of. There's Planet Fitness that's everywhere. Everybody knows Planet Fitness. And then there are the more lucrative types of gyms that cost a lot more, but it has a diversity of people and better like complementary stuff. So I decided to go with Planet Fitness because it's cheaper, you know, why not? But these damn, what, what are the names of these machines? These damn machines were so freaking hard to get started. The treadmills, why are they so freaking complicated? It took me like five minutes to figure out how to get the start button to actually start. It was so damn complicated. And this is why I honestly believe a lot of women don't go to the gym because when we're there we have no freaking clue what to do do you know many times i've been in a gym just looking around like okay what 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 does what, what what do i do what does this machine do is am i doing this right like what the hell am i doing and like i wish there was like more free flow of information in a gym where people just try to help you out but i just wish there would be more help or you know but yeah half the time i'm at the gym i have no clue what to do i'm just doing what i can do which is kind of sad <laughs> but that's it oh this white guy right here he was kind of weird but he was the one who helped me get the treadmill started so thank you weird white guy you did me a service i guess so i did the treadmill thing for about 10 to 15 minutes because it was the easiest thing to do it was what i knew how to do and it's like the best cardio workout i guess and then there was this shit i was so lost with this one like i was doing it and it felt like nothing was happening so i wondered if i was doing it right which i obviously don't think i was so i went to the next best thing i guess which is jump rope i bought my own jump rope and that also didn't work then i left the gym because it was just way too crowded the only person who's in love with an exposed brick wall like it's such an aesthetic especially with like the um the yellow lights like the, like you see in the background it's such a vibe i really want an apartment with an accent wall that is just completely exposed bricks one day anyways i was trying to get some work done in this cafe and i just couldn't i couldn't focus i was thinking about all the money i was spending this week and all the things i want to accomplish that i haven't accomplished it was just a lot so i left and went home anyways you guys um oh, let me disconnect this thing maybe y'all can't hear me <laughs> Anyways, you guys, I'm done with downtown Brooklyn. I don't think you guys can hear me, but yeah, I'm I'm done. I went to the gym. I went to a cafe. I did absolutely nothing at the gym, nothing at the cafe. But I, let me not say I did nothing. I did something. But all right, so guys, hear me out. It's like 11:30 right now, and I'm editing this video. Um, what I was trying to say is like I like 
going to the gym because it motivates me to want to work out because there's like it's an it's an environment for working out there's other people working out there's equipment there are equipment there is equipment there are equipment okay never mind yeah there there are those stuff there to help you work out and yeah so it's an environment for working out but what was wrong with this gym was the fact that like there was too much people there was too much freaking people I was stepping on people at that gym. And what was weird was the fact that they were kids. They were teenagers. Like, what the hell? Like, teenagers, literal teenagers were at the gym trying to get abs or trying to, like, build muscles. And I'm like, what the hell? Like, you're a teenager. Go to the library like i i don't get it and i know for them it's like i i strongly believe it's rooted in some form of insecurity that they're getting from their peers because kids shouldn't i don't think we should create a society where kids don't feel comfortable in their own skin so they decide they have to go to the gym to lift heavy equipments like these kids nothing was wrong with them from my perspective they look like kids skinny little kids they look like kids normal not even skinny like normal actual kids like they're growing they're developing into their bodies but they were taking up so much space in the gym and i'm like why are they here they're kids and I don't know what their school life is like and what the culture at their school is like but whatever it is that makes them think that this is what they need to do like my heart goes out to them because they are legit kids when you're a kid what you look like should be the least of your problems like what you look like as a kid should not matter it should have very little importance and the fact that so many of them so many of them so many boys feel like this is where they need to be at means we're doing something wrong we're legit doing something wrong and they were taking up so much damn space (laughs) like i was stepping over these kids like in in the sense where there were so much kids in the gym and they like they were taking up all the equipment so i had like no space to like spread out and do anything or i had to like wait in a line to use a machine which is ridiculous and i'm like also i'm like the gym is ten dollars a month the cheapest for planet fitness rate is ten dollars a month so as a i'm thinking back to my teenage years like would i pay ten dollars a month to go to the gym as like a 15 year old a 14 year old a 17 year old my answer is hell no i'm paying that much to go watch a movie to go eat ice cream to go do something fun fun with my friends i'm not thinking about spending ten dollars to go work out at no gym at that age are you crazy no bro so something seriously wrong is happening for that much boys and even girls who are clearly in high school to think that this is where they need to be on a school day something's not right something's not right in the water bro